Identifying key features of linear equations requires us to find two pieces of information. There's two pieces of information that linear equations are made up of, the slope and the y-intercept. The slope is the steepness of the line. So it's how steep the line is going up or how steep it is going down, kind of like the steepness of a ski hill. It's also known as the rate of change of the line. The slope is represented by the letter M in general. And again, it's the steepness of the line or the rate of change in the line. The y-intercept is represented by the letter B. And it's where the line crosses the y-axis on the graph. So it's where the line crosses the y-axis or it's the initial value. It's that starting value we often refer to. So let's look at a few examples of identifying the y-intercept and the slope from an equation. The slope is always located next to a letter X. So whenever you see the number that's beside the letter X, that will be the slope. So the slope, or M, in this first equation is the 4. It's the letter, or the letter X is beside the number 4, so that is the slope. The number that is by itself with no X, in this case the negative 3, that is our y-intercept. So the number beside the x is the slope. The number by itself is a y-intercept. If we look at this next example, we have y equals x plus 7. There is no number beside the x, but there is an x there. There's one x in the equation, and so the slope in this case is 1. The 7 is all by itself. So a plus 7 all by itself, that there means that the y-intercept is 7. In this next case, we don't have a number by itself. We have negative 1 fifth x, but no number by itself. Well, that means that we have a slope here of negative 1 fifth. It's the number beside the x. So the slope is negative one-fifth, but we don't have a B value. There is no B value there, so we put it down as zero. When it's not there at all, that's when it becomes zero. The same happens in this last example. We have Y equals negative six. So there is no X there. So there is no slope, and when there is no slope, we say it's zero. We don't put no slope, we actually put the number zero. The B value in this case, is that number by itself, it's the negative 6.